Do you like pina coladas? Well then, welcome to Weight Loss Wednesday. I'm Chef AJ, the author of Unprocessed, The Secrets to Ultimate Weight Loss, Own Your Health, and A Date with Dessert, which is now available in ebook and soon to be available in a hard copy. And this is where I show you recipes for healthy, permanent, and sustainable weight loss. I'm having so much fun with my new favorite appliance, the Nutra Milk Machine. And so many of you have gotten one and asked me to create more recipes with it, which is my pleasure to do because I love this machine. If you're interested in it, Look below, there's a $50 off coupon, and it comes with this beautiful cookbook with a color photo for almost every recipe. So this is not your traditional pina colada because, well, for one, there's no alcohol in it and there's definitely no milk in it. And it's very simple to make with three ingredients plus water. I'm starting with one cup of cashews. These are raw and they are not salted. And I'm going to place them in the machine. I'm going to add one cup of dried pineapple. This is organic pineapple. I have got I got this at Costco, but I'm sure you could get it at other natural food stores or online. No sulfites, nothing but pineapple. And then I'm going to add one quarter cup of coconut. Now I know coconut is very high in fat and saturated fat and some people don't use it and that's okay. If you weren't going to use it, I would maybe substitute maybe a half a teaspoon to a teaspoon of a coconut extract. But the coconut I'm using, and you can find this in my Amazon store, is a reduced fat organic coconut. And so the one quarter cup has 90 calories and seven grams of fat instead of the traditional 21 grams of fat. So if you don't use it, I understand, but this is kind of what a pina colada is, is pineapple coconut. So I'm gonna place the top on, and then I'm going to turn the machine on, and I'm going to press the butter cycle for three minutes. Next, I'm going to add four cups of cold filtered water. Now, if you wanted a coconut flavor without actually using coconut, you could use coconut water here instead. And then I'm going to press the mix button. That didn't need three minutes. One minute would have been enough. I shouldn't have changed the default button. And now I'm just going to push dispense. All right, and then you have this rich, delicious, full body whole plant milk that's not just the water because many of the machines have you throw away the most nutritious part with all the fiber, the pulp. This incorporates it. Put it in a pretty glass, preferably with a glass straw. If you wanted to, you could probably just sprinkle it with a little bit of coconut on top and there you have pina colada milk. Now I'm going to show you after I taste it how to turn this into a smoothie. Now you can get an extra thing for the Nutra Milk Machine. This is called the Smoothie Bowl. And what's really neat about this, you can use this as a blender, you can use it as a food processor, and what's really cool is it's got these wiper blades. And so I've been using this instead of my Cuisine Art because I don't have to open the top and then scrape it down. So the way we're going to make the Pina Colada smoothie is we're gonna take two cups of the delicious Pina Colada milk that I just made. Now. This doesn't leave pulp the way other machines or other methods do, but when you're using that dried fruit, you are gonna get a collection in the bottom. This is not the nuts that are doing this, this is the dried pineapple. Don't throw this away, this is delicious. You can put this, this is like a dried fruit, fruit puree that was just too big to go through the screens to make the milk, but it flavored the milk. You can use this on top of oatmeal, you can use this to make frostings, and you can even use it. This is actually, this tastes delicious to put back into your smoothie. So that'll really bump up the pineapple coconut flavor. And to thicken it, I'm going to add one banana that has already been frozen. This banana was ripe before I froze it. I should 
probably put that a little bit smaller just in case. Wipe the blades in. And then put the top on. And then we're going to press the button. We're not going to need 16 minutes, that's for sure. Probably won't even need two. And that's it. You can actually use this machine to make banana and ice cream, but you wouldn't want to have any liquid in it. You want to use a dry machine. So now you've got a pina colada smoothie. And maybe I would put another banana in next time to get it a little bit thicker. But even without the cold frozen banana, this is really delicious. So I hope you'll try this recipe and if you like it, let me know. I'm Chef AJ. Thank you so much for watching another episode of Weight Loss Wednesday and I make healthy taste delicious. To your health.